the Faculty of Health and Medical Sciences in the top 50 to 75 uh, faculties in health and medical uh, research in the world. It's a university that really does support the mission of this faculty, which is advancing health and education in health and innovation. The university is very supportive of what we are doing. We've generated some really high quality graduates who've gone on to make a big difference uh, to the health and well-being of society. And the idea is it's going to suppress the overactive immune system so that people will be less likely to develop uh, asthma, allergies, etc. It is groundbreaking because it might be one of the first products which actually addresses the hygiene hypothesis and says, OK, let's try and do something about it. It's an idea that um, he's got these smart goggles um, that you can wear. The device has screens in the glasses that allow um, sort of hands-free operation of them and allows you to look through and look at things without sort of taking your eyes off the patient or moving away from the dentist chair. We can do better by our breast cancer patients and all other cancer patients and they deserve peace of mind. The research is to develop a blood test that de can detect small fragments of the cancer that do break off from cancers and then go into our blood. I think it's safe to say that until the last few years, our rare diseases have been largely ignored. They're not ignored anymore. So we've received letters and emails from couples and clinicians all around the world saying thank you for what we've managed to achieve here. The university is a high achieving, research intensive, comprehensive university in a fantastic location. I couldn't think of a better place in the world to live.